A saint evolved from the pagan sea god who replaced Artemis as patron of sailors and harlots. Temples of Poseidon became shrines of St. Nicholas, who also inherited Poseidon's popular title, the Sailor. Nicholas's Christian name was the same as Old Nick, or Hold Nikar, the Teutonic sea god known as King of the Nixies, sea nymphs. Nicholas was also equated with Voden. As European pagan deities were Christianized, the benevolent aspect of Voden became Saint Nicholas, or Santa Claus, who galloped over housetops during the winter solstice as the Elder God did, granting boons to his worshippers below. In Italy, Saint Nicholas supplanted a female boon-giving de deity called the Grandmother or Pasqua Epiphania or Bifania, who used to fill the children's stockings with her gifts. The grandmother was ousted from her shrine at Bari, which became the center of St. Nicholas's cult. Christian sailors carried the saint's image out to sea on his feast day, as pagan sailors formerly carried the image of the sea god or goddess. Some bones were collected in the 11th century AD, installed in a church built at Bari to house them, and labeled the bones of St. Nicholas. This was the real beginning of St. Nicholas's cult, though his Christian legend claimed quite without foundation, that he had been a bishop of Myra in the 4th century. As an infant, he fasted, said the hagiographers, who, taking his mother's breast only once on Wednesdays and Fridays, he became a bishop on account of his predecessor's prophetic dream because he was the first man to enter the church next day. He resurrected the dead from a magic cauldron. He instantly halted a violent storm at sea to save three drowning sailors. He miraculously multiplied a shipment of grain to feed a whole diocese for two years, with enough seed left over for future crops, vastly surpassing Christ's miracle of the loaves and fishes. After his death, he achieved even greater feats. His bones exuded a fountain of holy oil that could cure every disease. The original pagan god Nicholas gave rise to a Gnostic set of Nicolaites who worshipped him with a cauldron of regeneration as a fertility figure. They held that the only way to salvation lay through frequent intercourse between the sexes. Like other worshippers of the sexual fertility principle, pagan or Christian, the Nicolaites were suppressed, but sexual symbolism persisted in the sigil of St. Nicholas's day in the runic almanac, a furca combined with a yonic mandorla in ancient Egypt. This was as the sign of the phallus of Sat in conjunction with the goddess's genital oval. Another symbol of St. Nicholas was the cluster of three golden balls, adopted as a crest of the Medici family, and later as a sign of pawnbrokers. Mm -hmm. The Dutch called St. Nicholas Santa Claus mm -hmm. and carried his cult to the New World, mm -hmm. where the name was corrupted into Santa Claus. Mm -hmm.